Stephen Brady and I'm a first year communication studies student in DCU. I am from Cavan so during the week I live up in Dublin in an apartment with three other girls but at the weekend I go home to Cavan. I decided on DCU TV vlogs to share with you all what it's like living away from home. So the question is what is it like living away from home? And the answer is great. But ma'am if you're watching I miss you the most. See who's getting good daughter points now. Probably one of the first things I find most difficult about living away from home is being creative with my dinner. Um, I, I, it's not that I can't cook because I can think, well I like to think I can cook. It's being creative with my dinner. Probably for the first at least a week or so, I lived on a pretty much diet of pasta, sauce and chicken. And I'd come home at the weekend and mum be like, so what did you have for your dinners this week? Be like, pasta and chicken. Pasta and chicken. Pasta and chicken. And mum be like, oh Megan, come on. And I, like, I can cook, so I don't know why I didn't cook anything else. But I just find when I come home, I just don't really feel like cooking. So pasta and chicken's handy, but I've moved on from pasta and chicken. Second semester. I'll find another staple food to do me. Another home comfort that I really miss when I'm living away from home is a dishwasher. Yeah, you heard me, a dishwasher. Oh, I hate washing dishes. And you've gone to the effort of cooking your dinner. I've had to make my own dinner. I'm sitting there eating my dinner and what's staring at me only a mountain of dishes waiting to be done. And when I say a mountain, I mean a mountain of dishes because I am quite a messy person. So if I'm making something that would normally take two bowls, I'll probably use about 10 because I just can't help it. And I don't have a dishwasher, so I have to do it all by hand. And yeah, it's, it's, it's really, really sad. So since starting college and moving away from home, there's been one number that has entered my life that detest would probably be too strong of a word, but hate probably probably fits the bill perfectly. It is 109. Now, I know people are going to be like, you can't complain. It's not that far away from Dublin, which is fair enough, it's not. But the fact that it takes two and a half hours to get the bus, and recently, sometimes, it takes me three hours to get the bus from Dublin to Cavan or Cavan to Dublin, when in a car it takes one hour and a half, every time I think of that, when I'm sitting on that bus, I just cry inside a little. It's just a painful bus journey that I do not enjoy and I have to do it every weekend. Now I know I've ranted about all the things I miss and are bad about moving away from home but obviously there are good things too. It's great moving out, you get independence, you get freedom, you get to just kind of be your own person because I'm living on my own so I'm fending for myself, I'm making my own dinner, I'm making my own decisions and choices and I think at the start if I like had to make any decisions or choices I'd be like oh I don't know maybe I'll ring mom and ask her but now I think I'm just doing my own thing and making my own decisions and choices and I I like to think I am an independent person so and I, I generally don't miss home during the week and not in a bad way like Joking aside, I generally don't miss it. Like I'm happy to come home at the weekend and I like coming home to my own bedroom and that. But generally I'm happy to be living on my own. Well, I'm not necessarily on my own, but you know what I mean? To be living independently for the week. And that suits me, I'm happy with that. I know some people would probably find it maybe a bit more difficult or get more homesick. But I never, like even at the start of the year, I didn't really get homesick. Maybe the first week or two, I was up there, I'd be like, okay, so it's Wednesday, it's nearly Friday, I'd be going home. But it wasn't that I was homesick, it was just that kind of, I didn't really know what I was doing or where I fit in, so I just kind of wanted to go home to what was familiar. But now that like I have my friends, I have new friends in Dublin as well, and <clears throat> my college friends that I see during the week, so I'm happy to go up to Dublin and I don't wait for the weekend to come home. So overall I enjoy living away from home. Um, I put together that little montage of clips at the beginning to share with you my little journey that it takes me on a Friday evening when I finish up that lecture. So yeah, 
that is my vlog for DCU TV. Maybe, hopefully, I don't know if I'll be allowed after this one to do more vlogs in the future for DCU TV. And you can check out my channel. I'm just going to do a little self promotion plug because there's no promotion like self promotion. Uh, my channel is Meg's Monday, so I upload regularly on a Monday if you want to check that out. And yeah, that's it. So bye.